WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading uh, up 581. Nasdaq's up 171. S&P's up 63. Gold. Gold contract down $2.80, trading at 1703 an ounce. Get silver up 38 cents, eighteen dollars sixty cents an ounce. Light sweet crude up two bucks, ninety seven dollars seventy six cents a barrel. And notes and bonds. A ten year note up four ticks, trading one eighteen twenty one. The thirty year up sixteen at one forty oh two. And king dollar, king dollar is down at four hundred ninety ticks, trading at one oh eight zero five four. Euro is still one to one U S dollar. The yen is at 138 to 1 US dollar, and the British pound is trading at 118 to 1 US dollar. We get over and take a look at the S&Ps, folks. Bottom line is that uh, you, know, you get the, the pop. Uh, we'll see what kind of volume comes in. You, it is option expiration, so I suspect we're going to get some volume. You're at 55 million right now on the SPY, and you're coming into 62. So I suspect we're going to probably do about 80 million, which is not bad. Not great, not bad. The swing point is 72. I don't expect we're going to make that swing point. What I do expect is the way that this market, you know, we were talking about the last couple of days, is that, that well, there's no sellers left. There's no more energy on the way down. That's the bottom line. Now what we'll see is that, okay, what type of energy do you have going higher? We take a look at the Qs. The Qs are the same type of setup. What do you have with the Qs out here today? We've already done 49 million. Now the Qs have some juice into it. Because we have done 49 million already. Q's are going to end up doing 60, 70 million, and it's going into 53, and the swing's 59. So that's, that's a nice expansion. And that's saying the Q's are going to make this run uh, <coughs> 314. And right now you're at uh, 290. Gold. Gold contract tested the lows of yesterday again. Now, this is what we actually needed inside the gold market uh, because we had come down so hard with so many contracts. The bottom line is that what you're doing is that you tested it today. It's not getting out of the way, but at least you had the test. We went to 1696 today. Yesterday, the low was 1695. Yesterday, we had 266,000 contracts. Today, you only have 168. You know, bottom line, though, you're still at lows. And good old King Dollar. Just, uh, it's amazing. Uh, Kevin Hinks was talking about this today on the TD Ameritrade show. And there's no doubt. It's just like... You can imagine if the dollar, <coughs> excuse me, can go down more than, you know, 500 ticks. That's what we did today, and guess what? You got the action in that top side. The correlation is right there, folks. Stay right there, folks. We're coming back.